HIV signs in men. 11 early and later stage symptoms you should be aware of. Did you know that HIV, the virus that causes AIDS, is still considered a significant global public health challenge? For example, did you know that in 2022, approximately 39 million people were living with HIV worldwide, and among them, women and girls accounted for 53% of all cases? All right. Although the number of new HIV infections has decreased by 38% since 2010, and 59% since the peak in 1995, an estimated 1.3 million individuals acquired HIV in 2022. Shockingly, women and girls represented 46% of all new infections in 2022. Furthermore, approximately 86% of people globally knew their HIV status in 2022, leaving 14% or around 5.5 million individuals unaware of their HIV-positive status and in need of testing services. More so, it is vital to have access to HIV treatment, as 76% of all people with HIV globally accessed antiretroviral therapy or ART by the end of 2022. This treatment is essential for ending AIDS as a public health threat. Individuals who adhere to treatment and maintain an undetectable viral load can live healthy lives and prevent HIV transmission to their partners. The global targets for 2025 are ambitious, aiming for 95% of all diagnosed individuals to initiate treatment and 95% of those on treatment to achieve and maintain HIV viral suppression. In 2022, 71% of people with HIV had achieved viral suppression which shows that we still have a long way to go to reach our goals. On a positive note, efforts to prevent perinatal transmission have been successful, with 82% of pregnant individuals with HIV having access to ART to prevent transmission to their babies. Additionally, the number of AIDS-related deaths has significantly decreased, with around 630,000 deaths in 2022 compared to 2 million in 2004. However, Certain regions, such as Eastern and Southern Africa, are still disproportionately affected by HIV. That's why we need to continue our global efforts to combat this epidemic. Let's work together to fight HIV and ensure that everyone has access to testing, treatment, and care. As earlier mentioned, HIV, or human immunodeficiency virus, is a serious viral infection that can have a significant impact on a person's health and well-being. While HIV affects both men and women, the specific symptoms and progression of the disease can vary between genders. In this video, we'll explore the early and later stage symptoms of HIV that men should be aware of, as well as the importance of early detection and treatment. Early Stage Symptoms In the early stages of HIV infection, many men may not experience any noticeable symptoms at all. However, some may develop a flu-like illness within two to four weeks of initial exposure to the virus. These early symptoms can include fever, chills, sore throat, and swollen lymph nodes. While these signs may be easily overlooked or attributed to other common illnesses, it's important to recognize them as potential early indications of HIV infection. It's important to be aware of the early signs and symptoms of HIV, as early diagnosis and treatment can greatly improve health outcomes. Some of the most common indicators include fever and chills, swollen lymph nodes, sore throat, skin manifestations, fatigue, and night sweats, among others. Let's take a closer look at these warning signs to better understand what to watch out for. Fever and chills. Early detection of HIV infection is crucial in mitigating its long-term impact on an individual's health. One of the most common initial signs of HIV in men is a fever and chills. This fever can manifest as a mild to severe temperature spike and may be accompanied by sweating, body aches, and fatigue. The fever is the body's natural response to combat the virus and raise the temperature to create an inhospitable environment for the infection. It is important to note that fever and chills can be symptomatic of other illnesses as well. Therefore, if these symptoms persist, or if you experience other concerning signs, it is imperative to seek medical attention. Early diagnosis and treatment of HIV can significantly improve the prognosis for those living with the virus. Swollen Lymph Nodes One of the primary symptoms of HIV in men is the enlargement of the lymph nodes, 
which are a crucial component of the body's immune system. As the body tries to fight off the HIV infection, the lymph nodes can become swollen and tender, particularly in the neck, armpits, and groin area. While swollen lymph nodes can be a sign that the body is working hard to combat the virus, they can also indicate that the HIV infection is progressing. It's essential to seek medical attention if you experience persistent or worsening lymph node swelling, as this could be a sign of HIV. Getting tested for HIV is crucial in this case to ensure proper treatment and care. Sore throat. A sore throat can also be an early symptom of HIV infection in men. This sore throat is often caused by the virus attacking the cells in the throat and surrounding areas. The sore throat may be accompanied by other symptoms like fever, chills, and swollen lymph nodes. It's important to note that a sore throat can have many different causes, and it's not necessarily a definitive sign of HIV. However, if a sore throat persists or is accompanied by other concerning symptoms, it's important to seek medical attention and get tested for HIV. Later Stage Symptoms As the HIV infection progresses, men may begin to experience more severe and debilitating symptoms. These later stage symptoms can have a significant impact on a person's quality of life and overall health. It's crucial to seek medical attention and start treatment as soon as possible to manage these symptoms and slow the progression of the disease. In the later stages of HIV infection or AIDS, certain signs and symptoms begin to appear. These include rapid weight loss, opportunistic infections, and neurological symptoms. To better understand these indicators, let me explain each of them in detail below. Rapid weight loss. One of the most concerning later stage symptoms of HIV in men is rapid, unexplained weight loss. This weight loss can be a result of the body's inability to properly absorb nutrients, as well as the virus's impact on the immune system. Men with HIV may experience a significant decrease in appetite, coupled with persistent diarrhea or other digestive issues, leading to dramatic weight loss. This rapid weight loss can have a profound impact on a person's overall health and quality of life. It's important for men with HIV to work closely with their healthcare providers to manage this symptom, which may involve adjustments to their diet, medication, or other interventions to help maintain a healthy weight and overall well-being. Opportunistic Infections As the HIV infection progresses and weakens the immune system, men may become more susceptible to a range of opportunistic infections. These are infections that take advantage of the body's compromised defenses and can be life-threatening if left untreated. Some common opportunistic infections seen in men with HIV include pneumonia, tuberculosis, and certain types of cancer. Recognizing and addressing these opportunistic infections is crucial for managing the overall health of a person living with HIV. Early diagnosis and treatment of these infections, alongside proper management of the HIV infection, can greatly improve the prognosis and quality of life for men living with this virus. Importance of Early Detection Understanding the early and later stage symptoms of HIV in men is crucial for ensuring timely diagnosis and effective treatment. By being aware of the common signs, such as fever, chills, swollen lymph nodes, and rapid weight loss, men can seek medical attention and get tested for HIV at the earliest possible stage. Early detection and treatment of HIV can significantly improve the long-term prognosis and quality of life for those living with the virus. With proper management and access to the latest medical advancements, many individuals with HIV can now live long, healthy lives. Encouraging regular testing and promoting awareness of HIV symptoms is essential for reducing the stigma surrounding the disease and ensuring that all individuals have the support and resources they need to thrive.